The courtroom was solemn for another status hearing involving the high school freshman accused of opening fire in the Mattoon High School cafeteria. Police say one student was shot and is recovering after the shooting that happened September 20th. The MHS student who's accused of shooting one of his peers appeared in court not only with his family, but a new attorney, Ed Perino. Coles County State's Attorney Brian Bauer says they're still waiting for reports from a court-ordered mental evaluation on the student before the case can continue. Bauer says when it comes to juvenile cases, things run a little differently. Well, a juvenile case is a closed proceeding to protect the minor. It is started with a petition for adjudication, which is somewhat similar to an information in a criminal proceeding, and the court goes through and makes a determination of adjudication, which would be like a trial. And after that, there is a dispositional phase, which is the sentencing portion of a juvenile proceeding. Bauer says there are several ways a juvenile can be sentenced, including supervision, probation, and detention. Today, the judge ordered the MHS student to stay in an Illinois juvenile detention facility until his next court appearance on November 17th.